Hi viewers, welcome to Lama Solution. Today we are going to see about the hybrid solar PV wind diesel generator system in MATLAB. So this is a simulation model created for a hybrid PV wind diesel generator system. So this system consists of main grid. So main grid rating is around 154 megawatt and voltage rating is 34.5 kV and it is going to be connected to the transformer so this transformer right so this is step down transformer it is going to be step down the voltage from 34.5 kV to 400 kV and it is going to be connected to the hybrid system so this is a hybrid system the hybrid system is going to be connected in the 400 volt line okay so the hybrid system consists of pv panel system or pv panel array with the corresponding inverter and inverter control and here we have wind generator along with the wind turbine so here we are using pmg wind generator and here we have a diesel generator okay and and also the hybrid system right or micro system having a critical load two critical loads and one non critical loads okay so here you can see that this rating of uh, pv system so here we are using 41 uh, kilowatt uh, pv system and then uh, uh, inverter uh, voltage is 400 grid frequency is 50 so once go, go inside it, right, you can see the, the configuration that means uh, PV array is going to be connected to the DC link and then it's going to be connected to the grid inverter. So inverter having uh, inverter control uh, along with the MVPT. Okay. So it will supply the uh, around uh, 41 kilowatts power. Okay. So here you can see that uh, here this is known as uh, PMG wind turbine system so rated voltage is 400 and then uh, rated power is 1.5 megawatt and rated frequency is 50 hertz okay and uh, dc capacity voltage is uh, 1050 volt okay number of pole pair is 48 okay when you go inside you can see that uh, system right so this is uh, pmg and then uh, machine side converter grid side converter and uh, this is known as wind turbine model so wind turbine model is see the wind speed okay and then uh, rotor speed of the pmng and then it will be provide the torque command okay and uh, this is having uh, two control right uh, grid side control and rotor side control okay so here we are using uh, speed regulator and the pitch control okay so based upon speed regulator and pitch control it will be generated the torque command so torque command going to be given to rotor side converter right so rotor side control so inside you can see that so this is a rotor side control so here we are using a feed forward decoupling control concept okay and then here also grid side also we are using uh, dq control right we can feed forwarded uh, decoupling control by DQ control method and both control will be generate the control signal for this uh, uh, machine side converter and the grid side converter in order to uh, transfer the power from the wind generator to uh, grid side okay and next here you can see that uh, this is a diesel generator the diesel generator is rated at the uh, 430 kilowatts the rated voltage is 400 and rated frequency is 50 hertz okay so when you click inside you can see the uh, it's a synchronous machine uh, having uh, uh, this uh, diesel engine governor and the uh, acceleration system okay so this uh, diesel engine governor and acceleration system used for the main uh, this engine governor used to control the the primary that mean input mechanical input of the synchronous machine and then uh, this acceleration system used to for uh, control the field of this uh, synchronous machine not to maintain a terminal voltage at constant okay and then here we have uh, critical load one so load rating is 400 kilowatts and then here 
critical load 2 is rating is 80 kilowatts and then this is non critical load so its rating is 500 kilowatts okay so once you submit this one uh, you will see here right in this scope so it is used for measuring the grid power solar power wind power and diesel and diesel power so here you can see the grid uh, power is negative that means grid receiving the power from the uh, hybrid system pv wind diesel so this is solar power solar power is around uh, 40 40 40.5 kilowatts and then here you can see the wind power is around 1.5 megawatt and here you can see that this is a diesel power diesel is supplying power around 25 kilowatts okay and also you can see the waveform for a different buses right for example you consider this wind turbine bus right this one right so here you can measure the uh, wind uh, wind turbine uh, grid side bus okay so that can be you can see here right so this is a wind bus uh, voltage and current and then here you can see that uh, in this point right in this point you can see that uh, bv side bus voltage and current so that can be seen here right once again so here you can see the the bv bus voltage and current and then here you can see that this is a diesel generator bus voltage and current and then here this is a critical load one voltage and current and then this is non critical load voltage and current and this is critical load two voltage and current okay and then so this is a uh, grid side voltage and current okay this is grid side voltage and current and here you can see that the power of critical load and non critical load okay in terms of kilowatts okay so this is working of uh, hybrid uh, solar pv wind uh, digital central system along with the uh, grid integration thanks for watching our videos kindly subscribe to channel and also hit bell icon for notification about upcoming videos thank you thank you so much bye bye